Welcome back guys, thank you for joining me in another little episode of Satisfactory. This will be episode 18. We are at the base. The plan for today is to start or just do the cooling facility. And there is written crater cooling facility, guess what? It's not gonna be in the crater. Let me show you why it ain't gonna be in the crater. So, I put that drone port in there with the idea of sending up uh, to the crater the aluminum sheets combine them with the copper in there just to make the heat sinks uh, this is overclocked ignore that for the time being uh, but then again we did that only because we had the nitrogen gas in there nevertheless the rubber is in here so what we're gonna do about that I mean I cannot break that line so we need the casings as well for the fuse material frames and the heavy material frames as well so it's gonna be a pain to put in here three drone ports just to deliver everything in here just to have another drone deliver them back it really makes no sense at all so i deleted that drone port that was up top in here in the back is gone forever i made the platform in there because guess what in there we have a copper node so we'll be able to it's a normal one to take advantage of it just to make a few copper sheets as many as we need basically because i don't know yet how many heat sinks we gotta build uh we're gonna go in the crater take that nitrogen and bring it back here you see the platform that's what it's gonna be used for uh actually this one in here will grab the excess of rubber that you see we're sinking it at this point because we're making way too much for what we need it is what it is and from this how should i call it highway whatever we're gonna bring it here the nitrogen gas exactly on this side you know from there okay now let's see about building that thing how much how many how how much do you have to build that's the question you know so let's take a look at it and imagine something nice as you can see i've already put in the milestone i had the fuse module frames in there because uh drops from hard drives hunting yeah i think we're gonna need at least something like five of these per minute so we're gonna need at least five heavy Mario frames. Guess what? We're only making two at the point. At this point. So we're gonna have to make another factory for this. Ain't gonna be that hard. You'll see it. Uh, five of them. It's 250 aluminum casings. Okay. So we're gonna have to upgrade the aluminum. If we go with the five round. And nitrogen gas ain't gonna be an issue. Now. This one it doesn't take cooling magicis. Okay. This is like a standalone product. This guys, I don't know how many to build. Let's say five again, okay? I don't know if it's gonna be enough or not. I don't remember anything. Rubber ain't gonna be an issue it's in here. Ten heat sinks, we can make them. Um, nitrogen gas one twenty five, okay? This boy, if we make four in here, it's another hand, so it's two hundred twenty five. Heat sinks. Uh, how many did we set? Ten. Well, let's make fifteen. Let's sink some, okay? Seventy five sheets. Copper sheets. We gotta make 45 copper sheets. That's not gonna be an issue. With that miner that we have in there, it's gonna be fine. So we can make this happen like right now. Uh, we can make this happen if we bring some water on that platform, the nitrogen gas. The rubber ain't gonna be an issue. And if we're making the heat sinks, and this boy, nitrogen gas, gonna deliver it. 50 casings, they are being synced at all times in here and heavy matter frames so as far as i remember we're making something like 150 160 casings in there i think we have two con three constructors working full time for them so it's 180 nevertheless we're using one of those uh, whatever is in there just to make berries so we are eating 20 so we have 160 left which are getting synced guess what well, out of those 160, we can make three fuse material frames. That sounds really good for me. 
So that's why we're gonna do it like this. And let's sing here for a minute, okay? 150 casings, that's perfect. We're only gonna sink 10 casings. So we get to use all, almost all of our production there. We're gonna have to build three Mario frames. Okay, this is cool. And uh, the gas it's fine. This looks fine. This looks fine. Okay, so that's the master plan. It's gonna happen up top here. Okay, because uh, we got a pond of water in there. I think we can bring a line in there. If not, gonna use the other puddle in there. Yeah, gonna use the other one and bring the water next to the nitrogen gas, which I don't know. Maybe we'll put them in here somehow or come underneath with them. The copper sheets will be done in there. The outlet sheets are in there, but we could bring a building here. I would like to start from there, take the sheets, put them in there, take those copper sheets from there, bring them like that, plug them in there, start making the heat sinks in there. After that, we're gonna chain them, okay? Leave some space for expansion future. We could expand that way, by the way. And uh, making here the cooling. And then making here, I think this one will have to become a little bigger, but that's something else. Making here the fuse material frames. Uh, at this point, we're not making as many heavies as I would like. We're missing the pipes. It's a fact. Cannot deny it any longer. Okay, it is what it is. Since we started that production there for motors and for stators, we're missing the pipe. So we'll have to go at some point at the steel and modify that one as well. Well, now for the nitrogen gas. This one, it's a derish. I don't know exactly where we're gonna see it in a minute. Just gonna put a gas extractor on it. A few nodes, I don't remember. I think there are four pure and two normals on it. And gonna bring it on the side of this line. Good thing is that I have the bar and I can fly in here. Oh, I think it's somewhere around there-ish. Let's care for it. I think I see it from here, it's that guy. Yeah, it's exactly that guy. So we'll have to modify this one. Take a, a ramp, let's call it, in there. It ain't gonna be that difficult, I guess. And then come with the pipe underneath, under this highway. The good thing is that these gases, they don't need pipes. So it's just amazing. Uh, I brought with me not only a bunch of copper sheets, but also a bunch of plastic because I want to make that guy in there uh, to his full potential without overclocking it but at the same time I want to have a mark to pipe just to be able to transport all that nitrogen it's not that I'm gonna use it okay but I'm not gonna use it now we don't know what's coming in tier 9 there's gonna be a surprise we don't know. We have no idea. So, yeah. Well, I didn't want to cross that. So, there's going to be a little issue there. Uh, I think we'll get a little higher. Like this. Just to be above. Yeah, this will be fine. Above that uh, thing in there. That thingy. This thingy. Are we touching that? No, we're not. Amazing. Well, how about you give me some power in here, mister? Is that the mark? Two? Yeah. Uh, no. I want you to make a mark one. Uh, mark. Why is it? Mark one. Uh, 
Looks like we have a lot of bitties in here. Let's stop right in here. Plug that boy in. Do it like that. That guy will pressurize this well. When all of those <clears throat> nodes are start pissing out. We can move it, basically. Okay, I think we can start building. So I wanna put mark the pipes in here. That ain't gonna reach. Um Okay, let's do like that in that case. Then we're collecting all the nodes. Two, four, six. You said one in the back. Oh, this. No, it's fine. Good stuff. Now we can grab that and bring it, I don't know, in here, let's say. Let me make my way back to the base and see you guys in there. So, as I told you, I want to go under with it. We're just going to stick it in here. If I can, please. Hello. Well, I think I didn't unlock something at the Watson shop. Uh, not that. The shop. Let's see. Um, management, please. All attachments. Other one. Bye. Oh, sorry. Coupons. Oh my god, they're at the base. Uh, well, let's put down a sink in that case. Oh, we can make the nuclear bread. Amazing. Let's put down a sink in here somewhere. Got 11 in here. Perfect. So, this guy, wall attachments. Uh, huh? Why? What was the other one? As fix it amply demonstrates, you can never have too much management. Okay. If you say so, Ada. So now we are able to put it in here and go under with it because that's what I want. And then on the side. Good stuff. So we brought in here. Oh, I guess. Okay. Let's. Oh, by the way, I put in here these boys. Making electromagnetic control rods. This boy is making versatile framework. This dragon boy in here is making the magnetic field generators. We already have 190. 90, I said. We're gonna need 500 for the phase 4 in here. It's gonna be a minute, I believe. Am I missing something? I don't think so. Okay. Let's take care uh, of the heat sinks now. So we said 15 in here. Yeah, because then we're gonna use them in there. So 15. Uh, there's two of these guys. Good stuff. So we're gonna have the aluminum sheets. Now we need 45 copper sheets from there. So let's just prepare for that.
We need constructors. Fight for them. Copy. So this first one, let's say, is gonna make only five. And the rest of them is gonna make ten. Are gonna make ten. That means 45 copper shades. Means 8 ingots. And with that one, 90 ingots. Okay, so now we gotta invent a way to put 90 ingots in here. Okay, so I put three smelters in here. There's 90 ingots for him. Uh, we're gonna need to fit that miner inside of them. Okay, okay that's a mark 2 miner. We only need 90 per minute. So let's make it 90. So we only have way too many shards on me. And you can go in there. So. Okay, mark to lift. Going something like in there. Yosh. Good enough. Ain't hey, straight, but it's fine. So, 90 ore. Coming in here, getting smelted, 90 copper, getting distributed because uh, between these amazing constructors in here, 5, 10, 10, 10, 10, we got 45 copper sheets. Uh, it's gonna start running. I don't wanna put it in there, split it in free. I know it's gonna be equal for all of them. But that one will get upgraded at some point. Gonna make more. And we're gonna have more smelters in here going that way. Maybe not in the rock, but well, it's fine. Well, do we have any? Yes. Outstanding. Let's go. So we're gonna have our 15 uh hit sinks in here. On a merge them, send them in front. Remember that we're gonna store some, we're gonna sink some. I'm not sure I wanna store them in here. Nevertheless, gonna put this box for now. At some point, I think I wanna drop them in here. Well, actually, I think it should be fine just to do that right now. Do we have place in here? Not exactly. Not exactly. Not a bunch of space. Oh. Gonna go with them like that. I'm gonna see here a small split there. Right in here. Let's make this one a mark too, just for the fun of it. And we're gonna say a hit, you're gonna send me the hit things. And to the right, overflow, thank you. Oh, very much. That's my target in there. I think I'm gonna bring them on the grass and that's it. It's gonna be fine, don't worry. It's gonna work just perfect. Outstanding. Good stuff, we solved that issue. Um, the first copper sheets are making their way in here. Which means, at some point, we're gonna start seeing the heat sinks in here. Amazing. Let's take a look at the next stuff that we are going to build in there. So, we got the heat sinks. We need rubber, water, and energy, gas. Five of these boys. Okay, so we're going to need a blender up there. Somewhere. We said five. Okay, rubber heat sinks. Well, the heat sinks 
I'm gonna come from the back in here. Oh, look, they're so pretty. Uh, the rubber. Well, the rubber, we got it around here somewhere. Uh, nitrogen gas and water. Oh, forget about the water. Fine. We're gonna make the water as well. So, this is my rubber in here. Uh, apparently, it's a little crowded. Yep. A little too crowded, if you ask. Let's get rid of that. Of that. Perfect. And now we're gonna send it that way. We got the heat sinks in and we got the rubber in. I don't like the rubber. It's gonna have to come in the back in here. Just to leave myself some space for the water and for the nitrogen gas. Let's bring in the nitrogen gas for now. Okay, let's try and make this one pretty. Uh, logistics. Stackable pipeline. So, one, two, it's exactly in the middle of that one. Uh, one, two, well, actually, let's just put it in here. Lift it up a little. Uh, yeah, don't like it too much. So, one, two, lift it up. Plug it in. Same thing we're gonna do for the water. How much water do we need? 25. Close by, please. Well, is that pun in there? It's a mess. I'm uh, gonna need a bunch of pumps. That one is closer to our level. But I'm gonna need to drag that pipe from there in here. And uh, I didn't leave myself enough place because I was stupid. Okay, let's bring it from here in that case. I don't like this because if I expand, all of this is gonna be in the way. So let's do it a little different. Now, of course, this guy ain't gonna have enough headlift for what we need. Because it is what it is. 
we're gonna make 26 because we need 25 oh let's see about that head lift i think mark one pump should be more than enough what's the lift on this 20 minutes what's the lift on this 50 minutes well call me a liar it's gonna be a mark two. uh yeah that looks good enough for me Are you filling the pipes, mister? That one has water. Do we have water in here? Not yet. It didn't reach this side. It's at a slow uh, stop. How about you work full time? Because I don't want to wait in here a million years. Now we're talking. This one should start pumping soon enough. Here we go with the pump. Got water in there. Good stuff. I want to put a buffer in here for this water. Let's put the buffer first. A small one. It doesn't need a lot. Ideally, it will have to be on that level up top in there. So let's do that. I don't know if that pump is gonna pump all the way on here. Gonna wait for all the pipes to get filled up in this blender as well. Before starting the old magic, you know. Uh, cut that line so that it doesn't start. And let's put some power into it. It's gonna fill up with nitrogen, water, and rubber, but not with the heat sinks. Yep, I think our boy needs a little more help in here. So let's put another pump from here, for example. Yep, this will be good in here. Well, while we're waiting for that one, let's not waste the time here. I don't have a lot of time today. Cooling systems. We made five. Let's take a look at the other stuff that we needed in there. Fused module frames. That's what we needed. And we set something like three per minute? Apparently. I wonder how many of those um, heavies we're building right now i think two well if we would have pipes which apparently again we're missing somebody's gonna have to make that one yeah well it is what it is let's see uh what are you doing cooling systems wow uh let me give you a box in your face uh, you're gonna have to be a big container please uh, 
Okay. Now, aluminum casing, heavy material frame, nitrogen gas. Nitrogen gas is just in here. Let's grab a grass. Oh, I don't have a grass in here? Okay, let's invent one. Okay. We got a gas, we need 75 casings, which conveniently right in there, you know? Done. It's a mark two. Well, actually, should we make it a mark five? Hmm, I don't know. Let's leave it a mark two for now. Well, no, because that build moves really fast. It's gonna have to be a mark five. Otherwise, they're gonna get sink at the other end, and I don't want it. Because they're getting filled until here. With the Mark V speed and everything that doesn't fit over this point is getting synced down always to Mark V. So it's gonna have to be a Mark V. It's fine. We love Mark Vs. Okay. Uh, heavy Mario frames. Oh, this is only for 1.5. Okay. Got it. We understand. We're gonna take this boy out of here. It's making two, in theory, you know, because at this point it's making none. Uh, gonna invent the splitter, smart one, in front of it. Let's align it somehow. And we're gonna say, because at this point we're not using them anything, they're just going and sitting in that box in there for our own personal use. So, ahead only the overflow. Okay, give me that, uh, gotta bring it in there, somehow. Through there, through there, let's bring it to that side. So, mark one, lift, going that way. Uh, in here. Good stuff. So this is gonna have his 1.5 Mario frames per minute. Already filled up casings. Uh, as soon as we have in here more pipes, because this is not enough, I wanna I wanna change that. So I wanna invent the buffer in here. Oh, the pipes are coming. Where exactly? In there? Well, how should we do this? Let's make some pipes for this way. We need 30 pipes per minute. Well, it just happens we got an amazing recipe in here. This says iron pipe. Okay, so we're gonna need two of these. The issue is we're gonna need a bunch of ingots. So, I'm not ready to spend 160 ingots on this shit. It's a good alternative, but no. So we're gonna have to go and modify. Seasoning, our steel factory. In there. That's for sure. Okay. What are we doing in here? One state per minute. This one has to stay like this. What are we doing in here? Four per minute. This four I used of making one motor per minute in here. Two, I said. Well, we're gonna drop this one on one. Excuse me. For the time being, one motor per minute. Okay. So two rotors, two stators. Okay. The one with the lifts, and this guy with the lifts in the in the front. So in here we're gonna make two stators. We just gain six steel pipes per minute, and this guy we don't really care about it because he's not using the steel pipes, but it's fine. Um, Three, only two. 
but we gain the necessary vibes so that this boy is gonna start uh, working like full time here something like that as soon as we get the delivery of the vibes from our tractor that is which is kind of coming Is get 137. Hmm. Why 137? I mean, it's an odd number. That's strange. We should really go in there and check it out. Wow. Well, so. Uh, this boy will start producing those. Oh, I have 200 screws on me. How did that one happen? Uh, where did I stole them? Oh, in here. Okay. When I modify the recipe. Yeah, it's filled up. Oh, already filled up? Amazing. Oh, I think I was missing some screws from the upload. We gotta put in here. Oh, already have one. Perfect. We got in here already some heat sinks, but it's just outstanding. Gotta love it. This one's filled up. Amazing. Let's um, let's send that milestone because right now we're making the heavy. Th this one, not the hips. The other one. The Miner Mark III provides top-of-the-line resource extraction potential, making it even easier to contribute to project assembly. Project Part Number 8, the Thermal Propulsion Rocket, is the most complex project part of this phase as it requires turbo motors, and thus requires your best. Fix-It didn't think pioneers such as you could get this far, I am glad we have both proven them wrong. Both? I did all the work, baby. Anywho? Uh, let's see, what do we have in here? So, OC supercomputer and cooling device. Both of these guys are just outstanding. As you noticed, we built this on different because no point in taking that. I don't know if they're gonna drop again. I want them both. Depending of what we're gonna need, we're gonna choose one. The rest is crap in here. I wanna start scanning another one. Uh, okay, let's see how that one goes up there and check it out, you know. Maybe we have some fused already. I think I want to scooch them around, drop them on the grass and put them down there. I have three more boxes. So the heat sinks are going in a box. From there, these boys in here, they will have to go into a box. Uh, I forgot to connect this line. Well, okay. There you go, bud. I think that's the right way, right? Yeah, okay. And I had some on it. Perfect. We're gonna start seeing the cooling systems in here. And... Oh! Already have five fused modular frames. Fused modular frames, I said. Perfect. So, enter the next one. This one is done, okay. We're gonna have to fix the steel. That means increase the production. We got a bunch of good recipes. Uh, more HMF. We need to make more heavy modular frames in here. Uh, not with this boy here. Okay, no, this one is gonna stay just the same and it's gonna put them down in the box or something like that. But I wanna increase the production. You see, here we got a bunch of oil, uh, iron ores. Well, I think they're all impure. I don't know, honestly. We got one, two, three, four, four or five. I don't know. A bunch, four. Impure. Yeah, so Mark 2 is gonna put up 60, but 240 out of them. I think we can make 
some juicy heavy Mario frames in there. Let's see what kind of recipes we have for that. Well, we could make them, they, they all require pipes, what do you know? But if you look at it, it's only iron and concrete. That's it, because this ones we could do it iron as well, so um not ideal but it is what it is. Nevertheless, I think I can do Yeah, we need the coal for the compacted coal to make this thing as well that means only one thing. We'll have to get our butts in there and modify that. It is what it is. And on this line in here that's coming with the pipes, which at this point I cannot find because I'm in the wrong spot. On that line, I want to create a buffer from down there because those pipes are coming out of here. If this machine is filled up in here and that line is filled up, because it's going to get filled up, all of them are going to sink downstairs. So, the in there. The only buffer that we have, it's that lift, this belt, until there. That's it. So, that's not ideal. At all. Okay? Not ideal at all. I don't have a buffer in here. So, I think we're going to make that buffer happen right now. Uh, that iron, that wire is kind of in the way in there. In the way of my happiness but it is what it is well apparently now we have buffering here still not enough pipes i'm sure of it but at least we will not sink the excess i think that one looks really interesting in there if you ask me so let me let me just delete that that uh that that yeah, and then just make that one. Is that one the one? Yes. To this level. Nice looking guy. Guess what? Amazing. Uh, well, we still need a bunch of pipes in here. But until we're gonna fix that, we can drop down here, grab, I don't know, a few pipes from this box. And uh, put them in there. Well, actually, they'll drop down in the same box. <laughs> because that's the way the system is thought, but it will fill this one up. Okay. So that is gonna get filled up, that line is gonna get filled up, and the rest are gonna do are gonna return in the box. Once that box down there is filled up, then they're gonna stay here. Not until then. But it's fine, you know. Amazing. Well guys, I'm pretty pleased with what we achieved today. We're making the heat sinks, we get some downstairs. Some of them are in here. We're making some cooling systems. It's fine. Five per minute. I don't know if there is going to be enough or not. Most likely not. And we're making 1.5 lousy you now. Fuse monitor frames. Basically, we could make two because we're producing two heavies. We could put some summer sloops in there, but I don't want to do okay it's just no point this one the same no point there. so uh let's see how many of this uh, electromagnetic field generators we got in here because we've been uh, producing them for a while 278 well we're getting there let's just put it like that we are getting there i mean this boy could go a little faster here if it would have 625 um 
5. 6.5. Good stuff. 39 and 325. Those belts are enough for it. It's getting there all the necessary material. This boy has finished building, so all the ECRs are in there. There is no need for it any longer. Perfect. It's gonna happen at some point. So we're making five per minute. Uh, how many we have? A hundred. Two. Three hundred. Let's say. 282 yep 282 so we need 218 and 43 minutes is gonna be done perfect we at the end of the next episode will be able to send that mouse on up and basically take a look at the next majigis that we gotta build because guess what turbo mode is coming yep that's gonna be something else. The good thing is that now uh, having the turbo model unlocked in here, uh, we will be able. Oh, we're gonna use a bunch of those. Well, it's not exactly a bunch. Oh, we're gonna need modular engines. Here we go, more engines. We're only making one per minute, so I think. Uh, we should forget about this one for now. Put it lower. Models. Okay. So we're gonna have to make some, I don't know, remote factories, let's call them. In which you're gonna make some motors and uh, heavy modular frames. I mean, we got a bunch in there, but ain't that good. Let's see, did my hard drive finish with this can? Yeah, what do we get? Hey, look at this, turbo electric motor. That's very good, I was just talking about you. Scan me another one, please. And I think we're gonna stop in there with the scans, gonna keep those two. You can stand there, bud, thank you very much. So, the turbo motors. Um, it's making three out of seven, which is very good. Out of nine, which is not that good. Five of those and seven rollers. Well, that sounds good because he's not using those Majigis. Nevertheless, I would like him to use those Majigis because it doesn't cost me anything to build them here. I got a bunch of rubber that I want to sink. This one doesn't take rubber sink. Consume, not sink. So I'll prefer to use that recipe. Uh, so in order to make one, I need two of those. It's good. We're making them. We don't make the most. So yeah, fixed tail production is going to be the next one. After that, we're going to make the mowers. And uh, we're gonna we're gonna take a look at those heavy Mario frames as well. Guys, we're gonna leave this episode in here. Thank you so much for being here for watching this. If you like it, don't forget to leave a like on the on the video. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't been. If you wanna see more, and if you wanna help me, basically. And if by any chance you wanna support my dream of becoming a full-time content, you can do that by grabbing yourself an amazing membership. Thank you again. I'll see you in the next one. Take care of you all.